We want to pivot over to something that you sent over, um, building a roster around a specific NBA player with some stipulations added to it, a couple of different rules to follow. Um, we're going to see who could, who could construct the best roster around a particular star. You have a player in mind that you thought of? So um, I think we should go with all-time greats. You know what I mean? Okay. We're going we're gonna to build around an all-time great. And the rules are we're going to do one superstar, as in like mm-hmm. one, what, top 10 to 12 player. Current? Current, yes. Only okay. current players. Okay. We can do one superstar, one all-star, and – you want to do one rookie or you want to just do role players after that? Mm, rookie might be clean. I like rookie. Okay. So what is it? Uh, so we got the superstar. Yeah. I'm mean, sorry. We got the legend. We got the superstar. We got the all-star. We got the role player. And we got a rookie. Okay. All right. <clears throat> and I feel like we might as well start big. So okay. let's build the perfect roster around Michael Jordan. Hey, yo. Okay. Okay. So we might as well. So <clears throat> I will try my – I'll let you go first, like, with your picks. I will try my best to not, you know, mirror you. Dang, I, I, this got, is tough, I got, okay. I got, I got, I got my superstar. I got my superstar in mind. Mind you, this is no injuries. This is just at their best. The current players in the league. Who would you? Who would you pick? You can start with your superstar. Superstar to put next to <clears throat> Michael Jordan. Yeah, I'm. I'm gonna write. Let me write this list down so I can make sure we got it. Hmm. I got, I got two people all. in mind. Two people in mind. Just what I'm thinking. Mm-hmm. If we were talking about we no injuries, right? People are healthy. Imagine a fully healthy Kawhi. Oh Leonard. my God! <laughs> no. Oh, that was my pick, bro. bro. That was my pick, bro. This is like, bro. It's like Scottie Pippen 2.0, but the <laughs> offense is low key better. <laughs> That's what I'm saying, bro. But wait, that was, but wait. Bro, that was my this is what guy. I'm also, this is what I'm, this is what I'm also thinking. Mm-hmm. Imagine now, who who who's the best center Michael Jordan's ever played with? The best center? I mean, Bill Cartwright. Uh, Bill Cartwright, yeah, because he never played. He all he has power forwards with Bill Cartwright, probably. All right. Imagine Michael Jordan and Jokic. That would be nasty. That two man game would be crazy. That would be nasty. And Jokic don't really care about scoring. Like MJ can score all he wants. Right. Like that feels like the perfect superstar center to put next to to MJ. Cause he could get out the way. He could space the floor. Like and he's still gonna do the dirty work, rebounds, facilitate. That offense is gonna be moving perfect. Mm-hmm. Ooh, because I also feel like I can feel what I could get from Kawhi in a couple of different places. So I'm hey, man. I'm trying to get another big Hey, like, man. Jokic. Do what you I'm going to actually go Jokic. I'm going to go Jokic. Okay, 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 bet. So, <clears throat> your team around MJ, well, your center around MJ, your superstar is going to be Nikola Jokic. So, since you didn't go Kawhi, <laughs> I'm gonna go Kawhi Leonard because I the same the same thought process. I just thinking like, bro, he's Scottie Pippen 2.0. He's right. you're gonna get at his like at his peak. You're gonna get a elite elite defender who can still give you elite offense efficiency. Like, come on, it's just for me it was a no brainer to go Kawhi. It, like with the aside Jokic, it was it was Jokic and Kawhi honestly. Mm-hmm. So after that, then we're gonna go one All Star. Okay. So do you want to do people who only made the All-Star this year, or are you just talking about, like, whoever's made the All-Star I was All-Star looking at team? All-Stars this year. Okay, bet, bet, bet. Okay. Let me put hmm. the All-Star, Ross. Let me refresh my memory a little bit. And this, is, this can't, this can't be a, a top 10 to 12 player. Okay, okay. Mm, that makes it a little bit more interesting. All right. Mm-hmm. Um, hmm. Ooh, that's an interesting choice. That might be who I pick, actually, now that I'm looking at it again. Because I can't take my Tatum is too good. Yeah, yeah he's like, yeah, can't you can't do Tatum. Okay. I'm 
going to go with somebody that might be a little bit surprising. But I'm going to take Jaron Jackson. Bro, I hate that you know basketball, bro. I really do. <laughs> I'm looking at this list. I'm like, I'm taking Jaron Jackson. <laughs> I'm looking at it because it's like we need, you know, we got Jokic. We got MJ. Now we got another big that could stretch the floor. That triangle going to be smooth. It's a lot of space on the block. <laughs> <laughs> right. Um, but you know, elite, elite rim protection. Um, so you can keep Jokic in the, the pick and roll, which sidebar, they also need to dead that narrative too. Like yeah. watching him defend mm-hmm. the pick and roll this series, he's doing such a great job at just fundamental basic show, get back, show, get back, right? Be big, show your hands. Like he's doing all that really well. So you keep him in the, the pick and roll coverage. Have Jared play that, you know, Robert Williams type free safety every roll come over. You know what I'm saying off the mm-hmm. glass. So I'm gonna go with Jared Jackson <laughs> as my All Star. Okay, okay, that's definitely definitely a good pick. Definitely a good pick. Now I gotta shake some things up because I was gonna pick Jared Jackson. So now let me let me shake it up a little bit. And my options are between because I already have obviously MJ's playing the two. I got Kawhi at the three. It is like it doesn't have to be center or yeah. just a big man, you know what I mean? So my option right now, I honestly, and this might be looked at as like a, a a wild pick. It was between like a Drew Holiday mm. to run my one. I, my defense is yeah locked. <laughs> you know, I love bro, I love players who can play defense. I love two way players. My defense would be clamps. He can still run my offense. Um, he can still set my guys up. He doesn't have to score. He can space the floor. Yeah, I might have just I might just talk myself into it. I might. I think I'm gonna go. I'm I'm gonna go Drew Holiday. That and look, if if Jaron wasn't on this list, that's what I would have took. Okay, so you got Jokic, Triple J. So we got the superstar. We got the all star out the way. I got Kawhi and I got Drew Holiday. Okay. So now. We gonna go with the role player. Mm. I'm gonna need to think about this one. Let me think. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Take you listen. Take your time. I, I listen. I don't know who my role player is gonna be. Mm. <clears throat> and I need a like a a wing. I need a point guard and a wing. Mm-hmm. I okay. need what I oh I need two bigs. Damn. Hmm. What would I really want? Like we don't. I honestly, we just need shooting. I don't need nobody else that's really a scorer like that. Hmm. Oh, that's a good one. Ooh. Okay. 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 I also, there's some good options here. Some good options. Off the top of my head, just kind of like looking around the league, one of the first people that came to mind actually was Malcolm Brogdon mm-hmm. and Tyus Jones. I like Solely them. for. I, lo- I like, love the Tyus Jones when I was right. thinking of him. He don't make no wrong decisions. He's going to set everybody you. I don't up. need you to do nothing special, bro. I'm playing with MJ. Yeah. <laughs> All yeah, you got to do. <clears throat> That ball in the post, bro. I don't need you to do right. nothing else. I, I, I love I, if you go ties, I would listen. I'm here for it. I love that pick. But let me let me see one more thing. Let me I'm gonna I'm gonna do some pre-scouting. <laughs> let me let me, let me look at the it. let me look at the rookies for this year. Um because that may change how I uh how I go for this role player. Because I may get a rookie point guard. Let me see something. Oh, I just thought of I just thought of a role player. I might I, I might could have do to that take it. too. Mm, okay. That might actually be the move. Dang. I can't do Paolo. That would be too big. Him or Sohan. But I want somebody that could play some defense. I'm about to say, you still got you got to think 
I was like, I'm trying to plan out my rookie and my role play. Cause right. Because I, like, I, I know you're going to have the first pick of the rookie. I know you're going to choose Paolo. I feel like I feel like you got to choose Paolo. Unless he, he don't I work don't know. Team. It's going to be – he's going to be too big. Like – who you got? Dude. Can't oh, you got Jokic and Triple J. Little, right, shooting is a little, you know, it's gonna mess up the spacing. Mm-hmm. What Caruso play my one? <laughs> <laughs> he good. Oh uh, man, this is tough. This is tough. Me, hmm. Dang. And bro, and I'm got Bruce Brown in my head too. Hmm. Mm. This is hard. This is hard. I oh, I think I might have. I think I might have just did something. I think, think. I think I might have just did some. I'm playing. I got my people already planned out. Okay. I think I am going to take. Dang. Ah, I'm going to go with – I'm going to go with Brogdon. I'm going to go with Brogdon. Malcolm he just brings Brogdon. more two-way <laughs> than, than Tyus does. Better defender. Okay. Um, I, and he's still – I think he probably is a better shooter than Tyus, too. I think Tyus yeah. is a better decision-maker, better playmaker. But look, we already got Jokic. We don't even need you to do that. We That's get nice. out there. He's somebody that could potentially be a ball stopper as well with MJ. So I'm going to go, I'm going to go with Brogdon. All right. So since this is, all right. So I see your team, right? You already got Jokic, Triple J. So you can't go no more big men for the rookie. So I know you, you say you can't pick Paolo. So that changes who I'm going to pick with my role player. So that means I'm probably going to slide Paolo. So that means I'm probably going to need a center. I got Drew Holiday. I got MJ. I got Kawhi. I mm. want a center who can space the floor. I already, I, as soon as you said that, I was like, I know who's <laughs> perfect here. I want a center who can space the floor for my role player. So I was thinking <sighs> Brooke Lopez would be a nice option. Splash Mountain. Listen, because he could, listen, he could space the floor for me. He could still give me rebounding. He could still give me elite defense. I, I'm a, I'm, it was between when I thought you were gonna pick Paolo, I was gonna I was gonna pick Robert Williams, mm. but I I think the spacing is not gonna be good enough. So I'm a, I'm gonna actually go Brook Lopez. Okay, I like you're gonna, that. You gonna mess every, all my plans? Are you gonna be like I'm picking Paolo and putting nah. him in <laughs> nah. So I've got Brogdon at the one. MJ at the, the two or the three, depending. And mm-hmm. then we got Jared Jackson and Jokic. We need one more person. Defense is looking good. Hmm. Honestly, I've got – I'm looking at two guys here, realistically. Yeah. I'm torn between J-Dub – and Benedict Matherin. I really like Benedict Matherin's game. Mm-hmm. But J Dub. I like I like J Dub. Also, J Dub nice. Ooh, yeah. J-Dub's he, nice. The both of them are scrappy on defense. J Dub mm-hmm. a little bit more more consistent shooter. <clears throat> mm-hmm. Mm, okay. What do I really need here? Is that might be like defense is. I think we already good on a lot. So I could go J Dub, but Benedict Matherin also I think would be a nice fit. Is there anybody I'm missing? Like, let me scroll through and sure I'm not missing. <laughs> hey, Kenny Lofton. Yo. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Bro- Brogdon, MJ. Yeah, defense is defense is there. Defense nice. is there with good speed. I like your team. Your team is very, very solid. If I'm just solely going off of this year and not trying to look on potential, I'm going to go with – I 
God dang, bro. How tall is Benedict Matthew? I need to look at one. <laughs> six, six, two, ten, put up 17 a night. Dang. And then J Dub. Six, six. <laughs> better efficiency. Better sh- I'm gonna go with J Dub. I'm gonna go with Jalen Williams. Out of okay. the the this is the Santa Clara Jalen Williams for y'all to make sure y'all don't get it confused. Right. All right. <clears throat> all right. Um. All right. Bet. And then I feel like, you know I gotta go Paulo. Like fair, yeah. I I I, I can't pass that up. I gotta go Paulo. So the team, the perfect team around MJ. Your team is Jokic, Triple J, Brogdon, Jalen Williams, MJ. Obviously, my team is Kawhi, Drew Holiday, Brooke Lopez, Paulo Ben. Uh, uh, yeah, Paulo Bencaro and MJ. So. Y'all, y'all let us know which team y'all think is the best. This, this is, these are some nice teams, though. These are some nice teams. See, this might be the one we have to put in 2K. This, this might definitely. be the one we got to put is, in this 2K. Is, this might be the one. Bring that, bring that to the blacktop first and foremost. <laughs> <laughs> we got Brogdon, MJ, Jada, Triple J. The defense is there. The spacing is there. Yep. Got Jokic, who could damn near run a one. Right. <laughs> <laughs> Set everybody up. I got Kawhi. My defense is crazy though. Like my defense is Kawhi and home. MJ is crazy. <laughs> with Drew Holiday. Yeah. Like, dang. And Brooke Lopez and nah, my team is crazy. My defense is insane. I like this though. This I, this is this is a fun one. We got we definitely gotta keep doing more of these. This oh yeah. Fun. Oh yeah, definitely. 